60 minnows in here. I can't catch one. What's up guys, Justin and Kyle are here with the Exist Outdoors YouTube channel and today we are fishing Jennings Randolph Lake. It's in West Virginia, it's beautiful here. Uh, we spent the night at the uh, campground here, it's uh, the Robert W. Craig campground. It's really beautiful, the people that run it are extremely nice. If you get a chance, I definitely recommend camping there. Uh, so we came out this morning, we got pretty warm water temps. But we're going to try to uh, do some slip bobbering. We've got some bottom bouncers. Uh, our main goal today is to catch some walleye. But as you very well know, whatever bites is going in the box. It's always the best type of fish. <laughs> fish that bite. <laughs> Those I like. We absolutely love whatever fish bites. So as long as it's legal, it's going in the box and it's going to be supper. So thanks for watching. Um, Almost put that one on the back. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching and hope you enjoy. Sixty minnows in here. I can't catch one. Got one. There's one. Here we go. Good deal. Oh, what he is. <laughs> Look guy. at that bluegill. Holy cow. That is certainly the biggest bluegill I have ever caught. Dang. I... <laughs> <laughs> wow. I was like, am I picking up a fish? Or is this minnow just going absolutely berserk? Oh, I'll tell you what. We get a couple more of them. We got a meal. Not quite the target species, but and we're opportunistic. And they'll eat just fine. Bringing it up, it felt like it was much. Bring the net up here, Gabriel. What do we got? Man, he's right there. Oh my here soul. Here we come, here we come, here we come. Yeah, buddy. Yes, sir. Holy smokes. Didn't expect that. It was just sitting out there. Yeah. I'm just like, you know, slack line. 
just kind of watching the bobber, thinking about setting the pole down and throwing the crank out through there. All of a sudden my line, like where I'm seeing it in the water, just comes running straight at me. I'm like, what? <laughs> What's coming underneath of these logs? This is gonna be a problem. Like, get it tight and like yank a little bit to make sure there's a hook set. And I'm like, well, I think there's a fish on here. I look down, he's underneath all these logs. I gotta draw him the whole way back up by leaning out over top of it. Oh. I'll tell you what, I didn't expect that. I didn't either, bud. That's a good fish. That is a good fish, Paul Paul. That's a good fish there. I'll tell you what, we nice. were uh, we were looking for walleye, but it's been a little bit of a slow morning, and Justin just caught that big bluegill not too many, not too long ago. It's like you know maybe this will turn into a bluegill day because that was a nice chunky bluegill. Walleye, bluegill, smallmouth, it doesn't matter. Like you said, we're we're opportunistic. <laughs> We'll take the fish that want to bite. Um, we don't. Uh, we don't discriminate. <laughs> and the littlest rod possible, too. Ugh. Yes, sir, guys, that's a good one. You take it. Get yourself another little bluegill. It's a little something. He's look how chunky that one he is. He is chunky. He's wide. Man, they're eating good. You caught the nice big fat wide one. Fill the pan up. And you caught the baby. Got like an adolescent there. <laughs> It's not the bottom. He's got me around somewhere. Has it? Yeah. Here he comes. Oh man, I don't know what this is, but I think I need a net. Just watch that, watch that log, watch that log. Oh my heavens! <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, guys. It is a good thing we're opportunistic fishermen. <laughs> <laughs> what? Because... What in the world? <laughs> He's a fatty. Uh, Kyle loves catfish. I do love a good catfish. You gotta be kidding me. We have gone from bluegill to walleye to catfish in a matter of a few minutes. Not a bad sized catfish. No. Nice nice channel cat, I believe. Oh, 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 oh. Gonna say, there it is. Show that thing to the camera. <laughs> cool man. I mean, we got worms out, we got minnows out. I've been running a crank around a few times. Yeah, just fishing, see what bites. You guys know how it is. 
Sometimes it doesn't always get according to plan for what you want. You just mix it up. Working. Oh yeah, tail slap the fish line. Oh my. First time that monitor's been clean in a while. What? Wow. I can always um, take this rope and try to tie it. You know, find something that I tie off. Oh, that's perfect. I think? <laughs> yeah, the line was wrapped around the bale, so I got two really, really great casts. If it goes to pull us around to the shoot, man. Oh, there's a fish. I don't know what it is, but it's another blue gear. Look at that. Oh, man, that's another still. Man, he's chunky. Yeah, he is. Just on the old night crawler. Good catch. I'll tell you what, you're tearing them things up. Yeah, Catching. You're tearing up the fish count in general. That big scratch you heard was us hitting rocks. Looks like we have the potential to hit that pretty hard. That's what I was Holy smokes. What? I'm not even in this island. <laughs> you did that again. Yeah. <laughs> Which one, what other, what did you do that with? My backpacking pole. I was like, man, this thing doesn't have any power. I'm like, I'm really, I'm struggling to pull these small. I mean, it was fun. Yeah. I'm like, I'm struggling to get these smallies in. There was a reason for that. Oh, jeez, Louise. Good hit. Man, I missed that. I'll throw that little piece back out. Uh oh. How does that happen right here? Take this around to your side. See if you can pop me loose. I don't think you were stuck. Really? You just had that, I need Justin. Oh. Oh, oh my golly. Goodness gracious. Please. I mean, I set the hook like I was ready for him, guys. I mean, he's pretty. But he's also pretty small. Well, hey, that's my first, uh... I'll say that's my first non-walleye of the day that I've caught. Is that a good way to say it? Yeah, no, that's a great way to say it. Your first non-walleye. First non-walleye of the day. Yes, sir. The first non-target species of the day. Yep.
a little doubled up action for you. <laughs> yeah, there's a bunch of these little guys standing back here. <laughs> You know, guys, Justin and I do tend to double up when we're either fishing or hunting. Uh, it's been multiple times now where we've killed two elk at the same time together, which makes your pack out job, I'll say twice as hard. <laughs> um, there's a little one right here, see him floating? Yeah. And then, uh, let's see, Lake Erie, we doubled up on those two walleye in the morning, right? Yeah, check that video out. Yeah, if you guys haven't seen, it's Lake Erie part one. I would recommend you watch part two also, but part one is where we doubled up on walleye first thing in the morning, and there was a fish hopped out right here. It was a double net, so as I brought mine in, we netted it, turned, and netted Justin, so it was pretty cool footage. Uh, it was a lot of fun, uh, so go check that out. We'll put the link down in the description, and then maybe try to put it here on the screen somewhere if I remember how to do that, so. Where are those little ones? are big ones, right? Can you see my line? There it is. Here. What's that? Something's going on there. Oh shoot! Jaber, got yourself a fish. There we go. <laughs> I got stuck. You got the fish. <laughs> Sir, thugs. What's going on? Look how mean he looks. <laughs> yeah, he's grumpy. He's got like a big old uh, frown on. Sit down. Y'all didn't see that. like a nice healthy snack in the middle of the day. What's he got? Yep, that's about what I assumed. <laughs> oh my goodness. Chocolate. Yeah. Absolutely delicious. All natural, it's what he likes. It's a bar. Energy bar. Where do you get your energy from? Oh, straight sugar. That's my nutty buddy bar. <laughs> straight sugar. You are a nutty buddy. <laughs>
freaking time. Right, guys? <laughs> How many times did you miss this a little bit? Um, oh, that's a good idea, Jay. There we hey, go. Let's bring him in together. <laughs> we both caught him. We both caught him. It was my fish anyway. Alright guys, we just finished up uh, fishing here at Jennings Randolph Lake. Uh, we had a blast. Conditions were tough. It really got windy there in the end. But we made the best of it. We uh, ended up with one walleye, one catfish, and then we caught uh, four keeper bluegill. We actually caught a mess of bluegill, but they were all uh, pretty small. A couple of rock bass in there. And yeah, it was it was an absolute blast. Yeah, we did have fun. It, it, it was it was a blast. <laughs> I think we ended with like four or five different species caught. So yeah. I mean, you can't ask for much more than that. Conditions were amazing. So we hope you enjoyed watching this video. Uh, if you uh, want to see more, check out our playlist. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you. All right, guys. Well, looks like we're gonna head in. We ended with three cats. <laughs> Three cats. <laughs> Shut up. Uh, <laughs> 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 All right, guys, we're gonna head in. Uh, we're gonna head back to the boat. No. We're in the boat. <laughs>